Well, <laughs> what you just saw was kind of what I expected to happen. So um, on yesterday's video, I talked a little bit about uh, my grandparents' house and the whole tornado situation that happened there and how things got donated. Well, one of the things that was donated in droves were these containers. And when we cleaned out their shop <clears throat> and uh, did the estate sale, there were a ton of these containers still left. So all of the ones where they had lids to them, I took and brought home because with my kids being the age they are, over the next couple of years they're going to be moving out and I know we're going to need boxes and stuff for moving so I just went ahead and took those home with me and I was going to use two of them for one for fall and winter and one for spring and summer decorations and I had a feeling whenever I grabbed these that they were not going to be big enough. Um, volume wise I think they would be fine but the shape, they're tall and skinny. And I wasn't really sure <clears throat> how things like these flowers were going to work because they're so long. Now, mind you, I'm going to be cutting a lot of it off, so that'll be good. But, you know, it didn't even come close to fitting inside that container. So I did have to swap it out for a bigger size. Problem is, I only have one of these that's the size that's left. And this is it. So for the spring and summer decorations, I'm going to have to figure out another container. And I'm getting ready to start um, organizing my storage area. And I'm going to take you down with me to do that. But what I might end up doing, because so much of my Christmas stuff I have kind of like rearranged and sorted, and I did get rid of some of the old um, like garlands and things like that that were wore out and shot. And so I might have space in one of those big containers that had Christmas stuff in it to downsize it to a smaller container and then use one of those for the spring and summer stuff. But we will see. I have this sorted out. I've got some extra um, paper and stuff for wrapping things. I'm going to take that down to the storage area with me too because I may need it to wrap some things up. But it is time now to head down there and start getting some things sorted out. All right, here we are in my storage area and it currently looks a little bit like a bomb went off in it. I know you can't see much right now, but I'll do a little pan of everything and pop in here so you can see the rest of the mess. <laughs> But what I need to do is I'm going to bring down <clears throat> the container I just started and I'm going to pull out some of the stuff from my fall decorations that I'm going to put in that. And I have a bin right over there that has a couple things just kind of tossed in so I want to sort and organize that a little bit. I haven't started putting my Christmas stuff away yet but I have rooted through it quite a bit so some of the stuff that's kind of just out right now I am going to either put away or get rid of because there's still like some garlands laying here and um, you know I used everything that I need to use so anything that didn't get used is just extra stuff and there's no reason to store it if I don't actually have a use for it. A lot of the garlands were like this one is just old and it's very thin and wispy and there's not much left of it anymore and there's no point in hanging on to something that I'm not going to use so um, I think when I do that I'll have a bin that will be free for spring and summer stuff 
But that's kind of the plan and I'm not gonna chat too much because I wanna get to work on this. That is all sorted, at least for now. Um, when I do take my Christmas decorations down and put them away, I'll have to kind of reconfigure a few things as I put decorations back in different bins. I'll probably kind of rearrange what I have in different bins, um, but I'm pretty content with where things are at. So um, it was also really nice to see some of the things that have been put away for a few months now that tend to just be out for all of the rest of the year and kind of getting those things swapped out and reminding myself of what I have. and. I think I'm going to be pretty satisfied with the way things are this year. So here's to hoping and for keeping me accountable for everything. And I thank you for watching and I will see you back here again very soon.